Welcome back everybody to Final Fantasy 7 Remake. Let's get into it. This is what I don't understand. If they already like willing to go this far, why do they need to like kind of pretend that? <sighs> because initially, like they blame the reactor and going out of control to the avalanche, right? Like to make it like, oh, they are in cahoots with Uthai, right? So just if you're going to go this far, just 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 go what what with Uthai first. <laughs> It's pretty sure we're Molly! Molly! It was us. We did this. No, you can't think like that. Exactly. Whatever came before, it was Shinra that pulled the trigger today. Am I right? Barrett. Marlene's fine. Huh? Aerith found her. Aerith? Is that the girl they took? Yeah. That's her. Hmm. What the hell's going on? I asked Aerith to find Marlene and take her somewhere safe. And she did? You sure? Hey, where are you going? Oh, Barrett. 
wind let's put ice back on I never did use prayer material, huh? How could this the heck hell is going on? When is hell going to arrive? This wasn't an accident. I can't even imagine. I said, where you going? Aerith's house. It's in the Sector 5 slums. And that's where Marlene is? Where we hope she is. Tell me she is. Give me something to hang on to. Even if she's not, I won't blame you for it, I swear. Who am I kidding? I'd probably try to tear your head off. <laughs> uh, I get that. Hey Tifa, know anything about ancients? I know I've heard of them, at least. They come up in planetology books. Meant to be the original stewards of the planet. Could even commune with it, talk to it and stuff. That must be why the Turks wanted her so badly. Within my veins flows the blood of ancients. This planet is my birthright. <sighs> you have failed again, I see. <sighs> Through suffering, you will grow strong. Isn't that what you want? Cloud? Hmm? It's nothing. Let's go. God damn, I'm really curious how it all unfolds in the second part. Like there's a hole in the sky. Wait. Over there. And it seems like Aerith also seems to know some things. Like what the hell are they doing here? Their jobs, probably. Just focus on seeing Marlene again. Nothing else. Mm. I can turn that in, and we can do Chocobo fight. Found them. We're searching oh, okay. the compound as we speak, sir. Okay, so they can't. There's nothing to go back to. Anything? Nothing as of yet, sir. Hey there. We're a pharmacy, but we stock other stuff. Too. What's going on? They may have escaped. Uh. I mean, let's see if I can. If this one is cleared, maybe I can get the thing behind now. Okay, this guy is gone. Yep. Good enough, Mughal medal, yeah. <laughs> the first thing we need to do is find a place. There's some materia. 
Madam M. Well, this is a fine mess. How bad is it here? Compared to Sector 7, we're doing fine. But that's hardly an accomplishment. Is it true that Sector 7's pretty much destroyed? You guys run into Jesse at the pillar. Yeah. Biggs, too. Let they were through, both in pretty Let bad shape. But Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. All right. Chocobo? Come on now. There's no need to be afraid. We're all scared. We already got this one, right? Yeah. Come on now. There's no need to be afraid. We're all I've been thinking, y'all. We gotta go find the others. Huh? If we don't look for them, who will? Uh, right. Hey, Cloud. Gonna need your help with it, too. Right. So this one just loops back, right? are still ringing from it this, wasn't... this is sector five right so where's this place you said marlene is where i think she is it's a house on the other side of town well come on then pick up the pace i'm going as fast as you are i can't even imagine how it looks on now get a plate really fall do you have any weapons for me no right Okay, so we got Magician's Bracelet. We got Gothic Bangle, Magician's Bracelet. Heavy Duty Bracer. I mean, this would go... <sighs> so, it does improve the stats. For... A because it's a Caligonous Bracelet, right? What we have right now. But I will have to pay a hefty sum. Uh, let me see. World's just too dangerous these days not to keep a weapon at your side. Okay, I'm thinking. <sighs> and it's. Or Barrett can have this. And then he can have two wind? Nah. Hold on. Get a plate really fall. Let's buy one. Yeah, let's buy one. World's just too dangerous these days not to keep a weapon at your side. And we'll give it to Barrett. All right. Alright. So let me see. I guess I can take the revival. Ice. Lightning we have on Barrett and Cloud. Aerith has the another wind. Tifa has the poison. Binding materia, you sleep. This could come in handy, I guess. It's a barrier. Actually, barrier would be good on on him, right? Because Barrett is our tank. 
All right. Sirs one and five may be a contributing factor. Once again, is there another explosion? Uh, I want to see if I can. Chadley is not here, huh? I guess he will come back later. Let's go. There was this rumbling, and then all of a sudden. <laughs> That's the house. Marlene! Marlene! Where's Marlene? <gasps> Is she here? Barrett. <sighs> Sorry, I'm Barrett. Marlene's my little girl. Uh, uh, Marlene, she's got short hair. <laughs> she's cute as a button, with the heart of an angel. She was wearing uh pink. She was wearing a she's pink dress today. Upstairs. Huh? Oh. <laughs> I said she's sleeping. I want to see her too. Come on, let's go look in on her. Keep it down. Don't wake her. Maybe you should join your friend upstairs. All right. Marlene, my baby. Thank God. Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. Because she's an ancient. Is that it? So she told you about that. She must trust you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. <sighs> About 15 years ago. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. But, he didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Every day I went, to wait and to pray. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words.
My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox. She told me strange stories, like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility, and how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no, this one, right here. I mean, what can you say to that? Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. Things like that, she'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the uh, knock. Huh? Uh, coming! <sighs> no! Go away! <sighs> hmm. Aaron. You know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the Ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, who are the Ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the Promised Land. <clears throat> Some believe the Promised Land to be a myth, others an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! But Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! <clears throat> but all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest. <laughs> and that they'll send her straight back home. Once they get what they need. Wishful thinking. I doubt it. You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. If I lost her too, I don't know if I could... If I could ever... Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe we'd be better off waiting a little while. Nope. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. Okay.
The main entrance to Sector 7 is buried under rubble now. So how are we supposed to get back inside? Underground passage in the park. Ah, good plan. But how do we get to the park? I know another way to get there. Aerith showed me before. <laughs> this ancient girl knows her stuff. Didn't mean it. Chadley, you back? Oh, Chadley is not here. Anything by it? There was this rumbling, and then all of a sudden... Just... just in case. Nope. There is a chakra here, right? Uh, I'll get that later. No need for now. My ears are still ringing from it. This wasn't... This kind of thing isn't supposed to happen. Over there. I mean, why don't we just there to the sector seven? Okay, this is the sector seven, right? Yeah. Keep moving. Uh, maybe I need to check if I can upgrade eight, seven. What is my level? So 90, 85, 80, 75. How many Mughal medals I got? Ten. I need more. I mean, I can farm them for sure. It's over. Enough. Ain't got nothing on me. Yep. Let's go quickly. Locked. Ugh. There, that way. We'll have to fight our way through. But it's our only shot. Yep. Mega potion. We won't hold back. No holding back. Was never in doubt. Nice. 
Come on, give me Mugu Meadows. I know I can just farm them, but you know. Let's make this quick. Shouldn't be hard, sure. I think it's the wind, right? Don't overdo it. Guess it's my turn. <laughs> Let's see what's here. Heavy duty bracer. Okay, I think we are almost through, but let's stop here for this one. I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay, bye bye.